is they tell you that's what they want you to do first. right? So in here, we have parentheses. And again, we have the subtraction or the difference of two logarithms. So we can condense that down to uh, one single logarithm by using the quotient of 3 and 4. So I can rewrite this as log of 3 over 4 minus log of 2. Yeah, it's supposed to be a 4. It's a bad 4. Does everybody see what I did? Yes, Brendan? This? Oh, no. okay. Now we have another logarithm. So now we're doing the, the difference of two logarithms again. So now I need to use the quotient of 3 fourths and 2. So I have log of 3 fourths divided by 2. Now, obviously, you guys can see that's not something that we usually use in a simplified form. So I'll just kind of do my, my simplifying over here. We have 3 fourths divided by 2, correct? If you guys remember, what I've showed previously is when you want to simplify 3 fourths divided by 2, what you need to do is rewrite this as a fraction. And then to get rid of this 2 over 1 in the denominator, we can multiply by the reciprocal. Therefore, that goes to 1, and you're left with 3 over 8. So therefore, my simplified form would be log of 3 over 8. That is the answer.